Hi, I'm Steve Hirschbach. I've been metal detecting for 50 years now. A lot of that's been looking for gold nuggets. And uh, I consider it an honor to have been able to work with Garrett Electronics on this new Garrett Axiom. It's a, a pulse induction metal detector, very powerful, good for a lot of uses, but gold prospecting in particular, it's really one of its strong suites. I'm gonna give you a short set of instructional videos here to explain how to use the machine and then hopefully later on a more detailed video that goes over different aspects of the metal detector. Okay, the basic power-up procedure with the Axiom is pretty simple. We've got two sets of controls on the machine. There's the direct access buttons on the control panel itself and then there's a menu where you have additional advanced functions. Power-up's real easy though. We've got a power button so we'll turn the machine on and a volume control is the first thing I'm gonna hit and get the volume set. Now the volume is gonna be whatever's comfortable for you to hear the targets at its maximum level. So you go over a, a test nail or a nugget or whatever you've got to make sure you've got sufficient volume there. The threshold control again is a, a access control. And I typically turn that up to where I can just barely hear the, the thing, just a slight buzz. Some people don't like that. You can turn it down a little, that's fine. But get it right about where you can just barely hear it. Sensitivity, I typically go to max. I mean, that's my go-to right off the bat. I'm gonna turn it all the way up and then ground balance the machine. You've got a ground balance button. That's just a matter of holding the button, raise and lower the machine. It just takes a couple seconds, your ground balance. So that's all the basic setup. The final thing I'm gonna do is actually hit the menu button and go to the frequency scan. And that again is very simple. Once you've got all these other controls set, hit the menu, go to frequency scan, hit the plus button and let the machine cycle. It'll take about 45 seconds. Go through and find the best five channels and then out of those, it's gonna pick the best. You're good to go. Once you've got your basic settings, and they are very basic, you're up and running, the key thing with the metal detector is to scan back and forth. Keep in mind that the Axiom is a motion detector and it does require motion to keep a, a target signaling. If you stop and hover over the signal, it's actually gonna disappear. So scan along, keep the coil close to the ground, no more than a half inch, or even on the ground for a lot of people, but keep it close to the ground. I see a lot of people with coils several inches off the ground and that's just, that's a non-starter. Keep her close, scan carefully and slowly and just look for anything that beeps.